Morning, it's 23rd of December 2022. Big up to the posters that are out on strike today and tomorrow. I'll be with them tomorrow. Also, the PSU Public Service Union, they're on strike, border force, for eight days as from now, so big up to them. Earlier in the week, we talked about Michelle Moore and the VIP fast lane and the £202 million contract she landed for her company. Courtesy of the Good Law Project, we've got some more info. So, it's saying six Conservative politicians led to VIPs being awarded contracts worth £5 billion. £5 billion. Get your fucking head around that. Innova Medical landed a contract valued at £4 billion by the VIP lane after his UK partner trading under the name Tried and Tested. Uh, after being nominated by Dominic Cummins, good old Dominic, he got him that four billion quid. That's not to be sneezed at. Company called Sure Screen Diagnostics got five hundred million pound contract after Liam Fox MP referred the company to Matt Hancock. Subsequently, Sure Start donated twenty thousand pound to Liam Fox. Not bad. <coughs> Excuse me. Hancock assisted a company called Ecolog International onto the VIP lane after being contacted by Genix Healthcare, a company that had donated £156,000 to Tory Party. Hancock's department paid Ecolog £38 million in 2021 after the government cancelled previously agreed contracts, so they got £38 million for doing fucking nothing. Conservative, conservative peer Lord Prayer introduced a company called Lumira DX to Lord Bethel. The firm was awarded contracts worth forty-five million. Lord Bethel referred a company called Octogene Limited after being contacted by a cabinet official. Octogene subsequently award were awarded a three hundred and twenty two million pound contract. Another peer, Lord Lansley, introduced a company called Acoro onto the VIP lane. And only Conservative Party peers, MPs and donors appeared to be named on referrals. No politician from any other party succeeded in referring suppliers onto the Covid VIP lane. So there you go. Five billion quid, all destined for NHS, all gone. After the public purse into private hands. And for what? The greedy, greedy buggers. I nearly swore then. Anyway... I'm sure there's more to come, because as, as time goes by, and I'm seeing him light up, and the shit unravels, you're gonna find one of these, five billion pound. They talk about five billion, five billion pound like it's five pound. It's an astronomical amount of money, and it's gone. It's gone into private hands. Somebody is having a laugh, and it's taking the people at the bottom, because we're fucking paying for it. Anyway, have a great day.